<laughs> Today we're saying good morning from Joshua Tree. We spent a couple days here. It's been incredible. And we've done a bunch of fun things here. But since both me and Johnny are vlogging, we're trying to figure out how to shoot and not shoot. So yesterday was Yanni's day, but I snuck my camera up a bit because we went to ridden horses in the wilderness. Do a fall cast with Yanni. And I've hung out in the backseat of a car, seen a million windmills, a million palm trees, a lake in the middle of the desert, and a really, really long train. And I've been to like the weirdest place ever, Salvation Mountain. That has some seriously weird cars. <laughs> and Swedish Insta girls making magic. Right? And I've flown a drone with really pink skies. And we end of the day with a movie and nothing else. Oh. <laughs> but if you want to see more of that, you should subscribe to Yanni's channel and check out that vlog. But today we're actually doing a collaboration. I know we don't do a lot of those, but when it's good stuff, you know I like it. So today we're doing a collaboration with Panasonic because you know that I've been in love with their GH5 from the Lumix series, but I always get the question like, what is a good entry level camera if you want to start vlogging? So today we have the G80, which we're going to shoot the entire vlog on so that you can see what you can do with a sort of lighter, uh, more entry level camera. And I've been playing around with it and I think, I think this should be like the perfect vlog camera for Yanni. But we're gonna roll around, do a bunch of fun things, and then see what you guys think of this. I think it's, uh, you know, it's, let's go through technical details later. Now I think we should go, we, we're gonna go hike and look at some uh, cool places here in Joshua Tree. So we have now switched. We are on the G80. And as you know, I love the stabilization on the Lumix series. It's like insane. If I'd walk like this, being shaky as I am with the other cameras, I would suck really bad. And here we have Yanni. She's gonna be the truck driver. Are we ready to hit it? We are. First, I gotta figure out how to turn around this thing. Truck, not so big of a turnaround space. That thing looks like a Mini Cooper. Mini Cooper truck. At least the G is gonna feel real small after this. <laughs> <laughs> how do you know if yoon has been driving? Smash Red Bull cans. What do you think? I think reverse up. Pull in. forward into here. And then back. Me, 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 me. Austin yeah, Powers. Austin Powers. <laughs> I love the sound. You gotta install one of those in the G. Bush. We do have a push bar on the front so you can plow bushes and stuff. Easily. Keep coming, keep coming. Okay, now turn it. A little soft there, but we got it. No problem. We got it. Good to go? Good to go. Sorry, truck. No. <laughs> There's no more room. This is a bumpy ride. Life is a bumpy ride. come from? Aliens? aliens? Definitely aliens. Riley's saying aliens. Guaranteed. I'm saying Jesus. <laughs> Jesus? Aliens? God. God? The only thing I know about these rocks is that they were in Entourage. Yes, I was just thinking that. <laughs> Benji! Benji. 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 Hey, say it. Benji. Benji. No, no, like this. Benji. Benji. What'd you find up there? Nothing. Benji! Benji! I don't hear him. I just had to do that since we were here. What? It's cool out here. I always thought that Joshua Tree was one giant tree, not a <laughs> national park. It sounds like a tree. But now we have properly seen the Joshua Tree and the surroundings. I think it's time to go hang out in Connie West's hood. That's my hood. 
So I say we'd start rolling towards Calabasas and, and once again <laughs> test our, our truck driving skills. We have no AC and it is like 100 degrees out. Extra hot today. Yeah. But I'm used to it, so we're good. Let's go. Ow. Perfect. All right, Trucky, you and me and, and Yanni, Calabasas. Alles? Alles, the seat is warm, so you know. <laughs> okay, Calabasas. Calabasas. Yay! Uh, yeah, oh yeah. See the belt mark? Yeah. Well, it's been one of those really warm trips. And the only good thing about it is that usually when we are sweating in a loud car where we can't talk, it's because I've chosen the car. But it turns out that even when Yanni chooses a car, <laughs> we end chooses. up in a warm, loud beast. Yes. But now we're in Calabasas. Unfortunately, Riley's not as fast as this old thing. So uh, we're gonna- it was to a good car. Yeah, yeah, it's fast. It was just a little warm. Yeah. I've been uh, rocking the uh, sleeve up here because I've been in the sun for the last couple hours. Yes. But now, uh, yeah, we got to wait for Ellie because they're not here. And then it Good is drive. straight in the pool. Wow. Oh. Impressive. Welcome. I don't know how you beat us. Uh, we, we're, we're a gumball team. Hey. Hey. It was full gumball uh, flashbacks. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah. We, I was getting hangry. I had to eat. Uh, I was yeah, just like, make it to Calabasas. Yeah. That was my only priority. I was so sweaty. Oh. Yeah, when it's I saw like 101 degrees on the yeah. temperature gauge. I was like, oh, there's and traffic. So we're almost like. But now there's only one important thing, and that's the pool. Ah! Woo! That is cool. Hey. That was really cool. Oh, it's freezing. I thought it was like California warm. Oh, but but now I'm awake. Voila. Voila. So, quick little tech talk. We have two cameras. We have the GH5 that we are currently using, and we have the G80, both in the Lumix G series. And they have a lot of similarities. The one thing that we love, like why we're on the GH5, is the stabilization. It's like a, a gimbal, like no other camera comes close to this. And that is why we're actually, like our red is at home because of the stabilization on this thing. So both epic stabilization, both weather sealed, both cameras, Foldable screen, so Selfies. you can selfie, which is something I was really missing on both Sony's uh, Leica's and everything. So other comparison, 4K on both cameras. The GH5 shoots 180 frames, so super slow-mo in HD, whereas the G80 shoots uh, 60 frames per second. So if you love slow-mo, GH5 is the camera. If you're on a, a slightly smaller budget and you value size and weight, then G80 is a better option. So both great cameras. G80 with the this 12 to 60 is roughly 1,000 euros, whereas the body, um, just the body without the lens on the GH5 is about 2,000. So um, quite a bit of difference, but they're they're like, for me, when we are shooting uh, like talking stuff, I feel like this would almost be a better option because 4K on both of them, and this is quite a bit lighter. Did I miss anything? Like a glass. Yeah, and then, and then of course, like on both cameras, you can switch the lenses. 
And then um, you should really not look into lenses because there's uh, so many fun lenses and that can be pretty costly. So this is why this uh, 12 to 60 is really nice. One thing that's important with the, um, the Lumix series is that you see it's a 12 to 60. And since this is a micro four thirds camera, it actually means that on other cameras, this would mean that it's a 24 to 120. It takes a while to like figure that all out, but yeah, you just have to double the numbers. So it's very versatile lens. And I think actually like for Yanni, I think this would be the perfect camera. She's not like a slow-mo mega nerd like myself and it's smaller, lighter, and it has almost all of the function of this. But now we've had a long day, like look at Walker here. Like that's kind of what I want to do right now. Yeah. <laughs> So yeah, we've had a long day and we're actually gonna say ciao and end the vlog here because we're going to a Thanksgiving dinner. And I don't want to, yeah, Hawker wants to be in the vlog. You haven't yes. been in the vlog in a long time. He's ready for Thanksgiving dinner. Yeah, I was gonna say, I don't want to intrude on a festivity here in, in the US with uh, Riley and Michaela's friends. So we're, I might sneak a couple B-roll shots, but we're gonna say good night and ciao here from Calabasas. Ciao. I mean, we'll be back real soon. So now, you wanna say ciao, Walker? Ciao. <laughs> ciao. So I know I said I'd film a bit at dinner, but we arrived to this like wonderful dinner yeah. with Riley's friends, uh, parents and like the whole um, family. Yeah. And I felt that, you know, it's one of those times where you don't bring out a camera when you don't know everyone, but we had a fantastic, true American Thanksgiving. Yeah, it was really nice. Really good. We even got like, we went around the table saying what we all were thankful for. So, Each other. Yeah. Mwah. I'm holding the light, guys. <laughs> but yeah, I just wanted to jump in, say hi, and say ciao for real now at night. So uh, thank you guys for watching. See, <laughs> thank you for watching. Hope you like. Let me know what you guys think of the uh, G80. See what you uh, guys think. I think it's a great alternative. So uh, I hope you enjoyed the whole vlog. A lot of different things today. So time to get some rest and sleep. Yes. See you soon. Toodles. Ciao. ciao. <laughs> <laughs> the light lady. <laughs>